Smelling good in here. The rain finally let up this afternoon and there are these, uh, the, this, I don't even know how to describe it. It's like a redwood walk through the trees that you can go through and they light it up at night with these tall lanterns. And I don't really know how to describe it, but it looks really cool and we're gonna go check it out tonight after eating. It's called the Redwoods Tree Walk and there are bridges that take you from tree to tree. So you're suspended up in the tree top. Well, maybe not the tree top, because you know redwoods are freakishly tall <laughs> and you get to walk from tree to tree. That was a way better explanation. It sounds cool. We're gonna go do it. <laughs> we're off to the Redwood Tree Walk. It may look like we're going out late at night, but do not be deceived. The sun is setting at 5 p.m. It is fall, we're approaching winter, the days are getting super short, so we're really only going out at 5.30 like crazy party animals. You can see it up there, one of the bridges. Yeah. We're gonna be climbing on those things. I wonder how bright it'll be if you can really even see it on camera, you know? Can you see me at all or not? Yeah, I can see oh, you. Oh, I should, I'm gonna grab the, I'm gonna bring 70. So I found out the, the redwoods are obviously not native, they're native to California. They were brought here in 1901 as research and they planted them over a period of 15 years and they ended up growing super fast. And so there's just these huge redwoods. They didn't expect them to be this big so quickly and the wood ended up being very soft so it can't be used for anything. So we just got these awesome trees to explore. <laughs> The sad part of that story is New Zealand was actually running out of lumber, so they brought these trees over here because they needed more lumber, but the wood was so soft so they couldn't use it. I'm sure they've figured it out since then, since 100 years have passed, but still, did not solve their problem. But cool place to walk at night. Cool place to walk at night. Here's the loop. Where are we? Here we go. We're over here, we're gonna climb up, we're gonna go all the way around. Are you dizzy? So we're gonna walk all the way around. They did warn us, no more than eight people on any bridge at any given time. So I'm a little bit nervous, but we'll be fine. We don't weigh that much. I'm very short. I didn't know that it was one of my life dreams to walk in the treetops at night, <laughs> but I'm really excited about this. It's actually way darker than I thought it was gonna be <laughs> for being called like redwood nightlights. It's super dark. Oh wow, and now that's it's the Blair terrible. <laughs> that's terrible, never do that. There's these amazing lanterns that are hung up. The guy who designed them apparently won a big design award, right? That's yeah. what we read for how beautiful they are. they are two and a half meters tall. Wow, two and a half meters, that's like <laughs> okay, the first bridge. Okay, the fact, oh, I can see the whole thing bouncing. Oh, that's crazy. <laughs> We're the only ones on it, right? Yeah, I only don't eight people wanna at a time. Oh my gosh, it's really swaying, actually. Can you see anything on the camera? You can see our wilderness out there. Yeah. This is crazy. This is totally freaky. I'm like walking over a parking lot right now. It's very bouncy. I'm not sure how high we are off the ground, like 20, 30 feet maybe? Yeah, sounds about right. Like enough that if I fell, I'd it definitely would. bust an ankle. And so all of the trees have these like suspension bridges connecting them. And then around the tree is a platform where you can stand and then they've got these information things. So it's a whole big loop. You just walk from tree to tree on these bridges. The California redwoods are the tallest living trees on earth. These ones are little babies. About 72 meters is the tallest one, whereas in back in California, the old guys up to 115 meters. They also told us not to touch the trees, but it's very tempting. I can't even see you. Can you see me here? Whoa, look. Oh, can you see him on camera? Yeah, they, they have like those laser lights all going throughout the trees. Can you see me here? Yeah, I can see you now. <laughs> Good to see you, man. Good to see you, man. So the reason that the redwoods grow so fast here is because in California it may not rain for five months at a time so they grow much slower but here it rains pretty consistently all throughout the year so the trees grow really fast. And we're getting all these fun facts from the science that we're reading and then sharing yep. them with you guys because... It's like you're here with us. Yeah. I'm just gonna walk straight in front of me. I won't be able to see anything. I just gotta trust the bridge. I like being on the platforms because they don't shake. They're not as scary. Hey, hey, it changed colors over here. It was red a second ago. Now it's green and blue. 
Fun fact, you see these things that look like palm trees? They're not, they're actually kind of fern that just grows up really tall. Okay, don't worry, I learned that this sign, forestry is actually one of New Zealand's most valuable exports, so they did figure out their whole timber problem, despite the fact that these redwoods, wow, that one is huge. Oh, you have to climb up to that one. Let's go to that one. 72 meters high. Step down. So this one is actually so big. You said step down first. Yeah. You actually have to climb this staircase. We're gonna get even higher. Kind of a little bit more scary because it's wet. This whole thing is shaking. It's definitely glass. Oh yeah, I saw a photo of this. There's like a glass thing that you can stand on. It's totally fine. Why don't you just stand on the glass, babe, real quick? No. no. I'm gonna just carefully walk around it. Ooh, even this metal grate is freaky. Yeah, like that's Super. a long way down. Oh my gosh, I can't even see the bottom. Can you? No, it's far. Wow. This what? compares how big these trees are compared to like the Statue of Liberty. Mm-hmm, because America. The coastal redwood trees are... Way taller? Yeah. And then the New Zealand redwood trees, they're making them look like they're almost the same height, but they're not. Oh, I thought this was New Zealand. I thought that was the New Zealand flag. That's the Australian flag. Oh, the extra star. I didn't see the extra star. Here we go. Here's New Zealand. We're almost to the end, huh? We are almost there. It took about 30 minutes. 30 minutes yeah. for the whole loop. So that's the big circular ramp that you walk up to get up to this level. So, yeah, we're at least two stories off the ground. Not sure if we'll be able to use any of this because it's incredibly dark. Uh, uh, there we, oh, there we are. Now you can see us. <laughs> the night walk in the Redwoods was really cool. Highly recommend it. Especially if you're here in Rotorua, need some nightlife. This is where it's at. This is the kind of nightlife we do. It's way yes. more our speed. Way more our speed. <laughs> nightlife, walks in the forest, day life, sitting in the hot tubs. <laughs> Dude, imagine this, Heath. You're out here. You hear a sound. What's that? Velociraptors just start running through the ferns. I could see that. I, I could, realistically, I could see that happening. 